update sure does that breaking news takes us to Elk Grove, Sacramento. Police officers opened fire at an apartment complex. to show you where it happened around noon at the Bella Vista Apartments on Deluso Drive, just off Bruceville Road. CBS 13 Shante Passmore is live at the scene with the very latest for us there. Shante. Well, Elk Grove Police is about to enter into its fifth hour of this investigation. The crime scene is hidden from view here on the streets, but it's hidden behind the apartments behind me tonight. We're asking, how did Sacramento detectives find themselves outside of their own jurisdiction? Just after 12 p.m., people on Deluso Drive watched a neighborhood turn into a crime scene. We actually heard like two, three gunshots back to back. Sacramento police say two detectives conducted surveillance on a man with a felony warrant. Upon trying to take the suspect into custody, they noticed a handgun. That's when the detectives fired their weapon. This apartment resident shares what her husband witnessed. And then he heard police sirens. And then as soon as he heard the sirens, he looked out and he said he could see police and someone on the ground. I asked Sacramento police what's its protocol when officers leave its jurisdiction. As a common practice, we communicate with our outside law enforcement agencies to let them know when we're in their in their area. Elk Grove police is on scene to investigate what led to the police shooting. We're going to be doing a canvas of the area, talking to witnesses, getting as much information as we can. As they do, we saw Sacramento's police chief on scene. The department said the detectives are not hurt. As for the suspect, police say he suffered serious injuries but is expected to be okay. He is wanted for a financial crime and is also a suspect in an assault case back in Sacramento. Investigation just beginning there in Elk Grove. Shante, thank you.